You may have seen this. Well, it's an ad on a bus stop in University City, along with multiple others. It appeared to show the Philadelphia Eagles endorsing Democrat Kamala Harris for president. The team later said that these ads are counterfeit. Action News reporter Leland Pender joins us now live from University City and a lot of buzz about these today, Leland. Yeah, sorry. We're not sure who or what organization is behind this, but we've seen these signs in Center City, North Philadelphia, and right here in University City. And take a look at this particular sign. It's been covered up with several um, copies of that statement by the Eagles calling them counterfeit. Now, we're not sure who put these signs over the sign, but I can tell you they weren't here just a few hours ago. Go Birds. Philadelphia loves its sports teams, but someone or perhaps an organization is trying to manipulate that love and passion for unauthorized political gain. Obviously, it's not to their advantage to be shown um, committed to a certain candidate. These signs have popped up on bus shelters around the city. Vice President Kamala Harris is shown in Eagles gear with a quote reading official candidate of the Philadelphia Eagles. In a social media post this afternoon, the Eagles called the signs counterfeit political ads. Somebody can't use their logo in a way that the Eagles organization themselves might not want their logo used. A spokesperson for the advertising company Intersection says paid advertising was taken out, possibly breaking a lock and replaced with the unauthorized copy. A statement said in part, we note that the Eagles and Intersection had nothing to do with the creation or posting of this unauthorized copy and Intersection staff will be removing the ads as soon as possible. Even though the signs are fake, fans worry the damage is already done. It's also in, in coded in people's brains, this picture of Kamala Harris with the Eagles. And I want to draw your attention back to the sign here. You can't see it anymore, but right here it says philadelphia.com uh, slash vote or philadelphiaeagles.com slash vote. That is now that is a legitimate website, but if you go to it, it just encourages people to register to vote and learn about the voting process. There's no mention of any candidate at all. We did reach out to the Harris campaign uh, for a comment on this to see if they're aware, have any response, and we did not hear back tonight. But for now, live in University City, Leland Pinder for Action News at 10 on PHL 17. Chari? Yeah, it's one of those attention grabbers that happened around the city today. Okay, Leland, thanks.